Hello everyone, in this video, I'll be sharing some tips for surviving the stable zone mission. Let's go. Doing the stable zone is difficult because we don't have enough time. But we can manage it. After the mission starts, take the supplies box and scattered wood quickly. And mine to hematite rocks. After that, craft 100 arrows, it's enough for the first day. Then go to this location to get a gun. After getting the gun, return to that location. In this location, we get medicine and bandages, so it's easy to survive day one. Kill this corruptor to get a firearm parts kit to repair the gun. Day 2, we already have a gun, so it's for gathering wood, stones for arrows, and arrows. Go to this location for survive day 2. After crafting arrows and ammo, search for medicine and bandages in remaining time. Find these types of buildings, they're useful for surviving day 2. We have a huge space to move and attack zombies. Day 3 is very difficult and the last day, so search for as much medicine and bandages as you can. Before 2 minutes, start running to the final location. <laughs> Surviving day 3 is difficult, so use medicine and bandages at the correct time. Don't drop your weapons until you get on the chopper. I don't want you dying on me in the last minute. Why do they build this huge factory right at the edge of the tourist hill? Cardis, Venus Medical, stolen real estate? Looks like we'll have to make a thorough survey of the island after this. Looks like the pollution on the island is somehow made the zombies even more terrified. Just where is this pollution coming from? Use open spaces to kite the zombies. All you have to do to win is survive. normal zombie. It's difficult to kill those three characters, so just run around for the next 40 minutes. 
Before five seconds, run outside so you will get some space from the zombies. It gives us a few seconds to board the helicopter. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update. Your support means a lot and I can't wait to share more content with you in the future. Subscribe and join our community.